everyone, it's your girl Wiza and welcome or welcome back to our world. <laughs> so in today's video we have another puppy subscription box unboxing. This time we're going to be unboxing the pup box. So funny story, we actually already filmed the unboxing of this but somebody knocked over the camera and we didn't save the footage so we're trying to unbox it again aren't we so he already knows the treat that's inside and um, you're not gonna be able to see the first impression but i thought it would still be interesting and cool to show you guys this box because we have a few months subscription so you're gonna be seeing it a lot more on our channel so i really like the actual branding the pop box logo really really cute love the purple and it says puppy bliss has arrived and when you open it up it has these little markings on the physical box it says hi my name is and i am blank months i'll try to fit buffoni in here but i don't I think he'll fit but he does like cardboard boxes so he'll definitely probably eat this box but <laughs> nonetheless when you open it up it came with these two little pieces of paper and this one here just talks about flea and tick season saying that it's here and how to find them and like good practices about fleas and ticks as well it comes with this training and development for your three month pup box so the really cool thing with pup box is that you actually have to take a survey before you like sign up for the box give the information about your dog birthday all that kind of stuff so they're able to give you monthly box based on his growth and like what he needs for that kind of growth at that month so i thought that was super cool it's super customized based on him and they asked for his breed so they know that he's a medium breed type and all of that stuff so they're giving me all products catered to him so to help him grow and what we need to grow at his certain times so i thought that was super cool that's something that i don't see a lot of puppy subscription box doing and everything in this box is catered to a three month medium breed size pup so i thought that was super cool everything is just personalized customized for buffones on this physical card i don't know if i mentioned it i got sidetracked but it talks about like potty training and training and development positive reinforcement is my puppy teething or do i really taste good i'm happy to say that buffone is fully potty trained he hasn't gone in the house and i want to say like two three weeks maybe He's really, really good. And when he wants to go to the bathroom, he just cries. So I puppy trained him and I'm so proud of it because he's such a good boy. Uh, we had one accident. He got really scared when the vacuum cleaner came on and he like kind of leaked a little bit, but that's fine. That happens. <laughs> so it's not his fault. But other than that, he's fully potty trained. So I don't need to do too much on the, in the potty training side, but he is teething like crazy. If you see my arms and like my hands, he got me really good right here. And it's just like, so bad i'm giving him bully sticks i've frozen carrots all that kind of stuff so i'm definitely going to be reading a little bit more about this and how to make him not teeth so much because that's kind of my issue right now all his teeth are coming in and i know that they bother him because like around 10 o'clock at night is when they like really start to go and he just gets really irritated and agitated so hopefully there's some good tips on here i'll take a look later but if you wanted to see i'll just put it there and you can screenshot it check it out if you want so yeah super cool up for a treat good boy sit down sit good boy anything for a treat so when you open up the pup box it gives you this little piece of paper and on this piece of paper it tells you everything that's in the box and a little bit of a description of each thing so that's really nice i love when this kind of stuff is in there because it like gives you a little bit of background knowledge because sometimes i have no idea what these things are for the first thing that buffoni took out of the box was this little elephant and it's ellie the elephant come you want to see it come and the really cool thing with it, it has a whole bunch of different textures. It crinkles, it has like rubber feet for teething. It has a squeaker in the head and his ears even crinkle. So Buffoni really, really likes that. And it's like a really strong texture. Here, come check it out. He has like this fascination lately with squeaker toys. So now that he knows that this has a squeaker in it, he's gonna love it. Okay, squeak it, squeak it. Sit down, sit with it, play with it. Yeah, good boy called Ellie the Elephant. It's by the brand Pup Box, so they just have their own toy brands. This is in the large size, so I'm assuming they had different sizes of this toy, but they obviously gave us a large one for Buffone. The next thing in the box is this little chewer toy. It's called the, it's by the brand Hero. It's a treat bone ball, so you literally just put treats inside of it and sneak them in there. So I have a treat here, and I'm just gonna stick her in the middle of it, and then you give it to him, and he has to search for the treat, and it's like super hard, feels nice on his teeth. So he's gonna go at that, I guess. Let's put this over here a little bit, see if he can get it. That keeps him really busy so I can just stuff it with treats and then he'll be able to like dig in there and get it. Get it, where'd he get it? Did you get it? Oh, he almost got it. While he's doing that, let's go with the next item. So the next item I got was this little treat bag. It has like a little belt loop on here. So I'll just go right onto my pants. Get it, boy, get it. 
And it has a little belt loop right here, so it'll just stick on right to my pants. Because right now I'm just shoving them into the pocket of my like my sweatpants on my leggings, and I just have like a big ball on the side of my leg. So this is gonna be super helpful. It has like a little jawstring to close up the treats, and a little, even like a little mesh bag so I can put like my keys and whatnot. Super helpful. And again, it's by the brand Pup Box, so I assume everything in this box is by the Pup Box brand. So this is gonna be super helpful because I don't have one of these little treat bags, and we'll definitely definitely get a lot of use out of this. Won't we, buddy? Yeah, he's really busy trying to get that tree out of there. I stuffed it in there pretty far. The next item is this little chew bone. It has like little spikes on it. It's called a chomp and chew spiny bone toy. Here, buddy. Here. Did you get it? It's still in there. You have to get it. So here's what it looks like up close. It has these like little spikes all over it. And it's made out of like a really soft plastic. And when you like twist it or bite it, it makes that noise. So this will be perfect to take on like walks and all that kind of stuff with us. The last two items are actually food related items. So we have some treats here. These are called liver lovers and they're grain free training treats. And they're actually really small. I was surprised how small they are for like a medium dog. I assume that they would be bigger, but they actually look very tiny like this. But I'll literally show you what one looks like up close. They're super tiny. And like when he goes to eat them, he's like, okay, where's my treat? Because his regular treats are literally this big. Okay, you want one, you have to go up, 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 don't be lazy, sit, okay, here we go, how are they, this is again by the Pup Box brand, there is no other brand on it, so I'm assuming again they make their own treats, you want another one, they're not very big tweeters, are they, but these treats will definitely fit really nice into this little bag, we can take them on walks with us, you can have a few more because these are small treats, yeah, and look at on my arm right now, <laughs> The last item is actually the thing that I'm most excited for and we didn't actually get to open this yet because the camera cut out So this is completely new. So I haven't had a chance to open her up yet. So this is dog's butter So this is like specialty peanut butter just for your dog So there's no salt or sugar hydrogenated oils corn or anything like that in it So it's all like good for pups. I give him regular peanut butter like the all-natural peanut butter But it'll be interesting to see if he likes this come up we have one final thing for you to try. So we're gonna give this a try now. I'm gonna put the lid into his mouth and see what he does. You like this? He loves peanut butter. I always put peanut butter on his little lick pad that I got from the Pets In haul. So it just smells like regular peanut butter. So nothing, yeah, it just smells like regular peanut butter. From every item that you buy, a portion of your money is donated to feed dogs in need. I love that. And it's also made in the US because this is a US subscription box. This is super cool. So when you buy this, it also gives back to dogs that need it. So I love that. So you're giving back, boy. How's that feel? <laughs> So if you are interested in checking this out, it's by the brand Dogs for Dog Dog Butter. This will be very helpful. And we can even put it into that little green ball, wherever it is, and we can get him to work for his uh, peanut butter. So that's awesome. I really, really love this. That is everything that we got in the three month pup box. So we got Ellie the elephant toy. We got this little treat bone ball and it has like a little treat still in there that he couldn't get. He got the top part, but he couldn't get the stuff in the inside. This little bone, little squeaky toy, which he's working on. I put a little bit of peanut butter on it to distract him. This little pup box treat rewarder pouch that I can put on my pants and go in for walks with treats with him. Little liver lover treats as well as dog treat dog butter, which Buffone loves. Oh, and of course our little three month puppy guide. So that is it for today's video. That is everything that we got in our pup box. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys like this month's box, if you think it was good, if you think it was worth the money. I'll also link everything down in the description bar below if you are interested in getting your own pup box and customizing it based to your pup. But for now, Buffone and I are going to go. Looks like somebody needs a little bit of a nap. He's getting tired. We went to the park today. We've had a very busy day and he had all that peanut butter. So he only has a nice full tummy right now. But that is it for us today. I gotta put the baby to sleep. Thank you so much for watching and thank you so much for hanging out with me. Catch you on our next one. See ya.